That may lead to the next question. So Shane Baum, who's a student here, asks, in recent times, what has been the most difficult obstacle journalists have faced because of the nation's polarization? I mean, it's difficult to, compl it's difficult to complain about having to uh, uh, like, uh, interview liars. I mean, that's not, especially after coming back from like a war zone. Um, I think the most difficult um, part of, I, I think it's twofold. One is we constantly get death threats because Donald Trump has demonized us to the point that we get death threats. Um, and if you are a woman or a person of color, uh, the, the threats are, are far worse, uh, at least anecdotally. Um, so, and also if you're early on uh, in, the, in the Trump years, if you were Jewish. So, um, like in the, in the 2015, 2016. So that's not fun. Um, that's really ugly and nasty and not what any of us signed up for. Uh, and then also the degree to which Donald Trump, specifically because he wants to avoid accountability, so he has tried to do everything he can to undermine anyone who would provide accountability, not just reporters, but the judiciary, any Republican who would challenge him, um, I mean, any institution uh, has, has demonized and undermined those groups, the degree to which you know, fake news and all that has caused the media to even be more siloed. So Republicans only watch this channel and progressives only watch that channel and all that stuff. That's unhealthy for democracy. Um, but the death threats are worse than that. But I think all of it's very unhealthy. And it's all much, much worse than it used to be. Much, much worse than it was in 2014. Much, much, much worse. As soon as he came down the, the uh, escalator, things started getting really bad. <laughs>